Welcome back to Ostriv. First episode of season two, I believe is what I'm going to call this, because I've played this many times, but I think this is only our second recording. Um, well, if you remember Ostriv, you remember that the very beginning is extremely slow. Our job is to follow this little tutorial thing to build uh, houses enough for these tents. I think there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine nine tents that we have to replace um so i'm just gonna get into it this map is map number four and um you'll see if you look at the mini map or if you're looking at where i'm panning it's got a bunch of rivers to the east the northeast i started pretty much southeast this is the red line right there um and the river, the stream kind of ends here, and there is stone. And just up the way a little bit, I think, yeah, here is limestone. So, there's a little bit of resources that uh, we can use. This map does not have unlimited resources of any kind, so a little bit crazy. But I think we'll go south with this building here and then I have to remember oh I guess we don't have to remember but we have built this <laughs> um, I was going to say I have to remember how to rotate I can't remember how to rotate but I will have to learn in just a minute uh, but I know we're going to need wood production we're going to need a thatchery for um Oh, what's it called? You know what I'm talking about. To get roofs. And there it is. Um, how in the world? Ah, it's R. Okay. So let's just put this over here. And a couple of young ladies will go and get some of uh, that stuff. We have to have two people working here. And don't forget this game absolutely beautiful if you want to watch um the zooming on this game is a lot different than farthest frontier in that i can zoom in really close and i can zoom out super far, far which is probably why i complain so much about farthest frontier just too too little zooming perfect so what this game what this map does not have and I may come to regret it, is it doesn't have iron that I know about. Um, it didn't say that it had unlimited iron, but look at all this limestone scattered about. Um, and someone in the comments will almost certainly say it does have iron, you just, you don't know what you're talking about, and that's probably true. Okay, we need two workers in here getting logs. Um, I would do more, but we don't have the time. Uh, we need a clay pit. It's going to go over here somewhere. Actually, it doesn't matter where it goes. So let's put it. Um, let's put it here. They'll build that, and then of course we need houses. <clears throat> now, the houses with gardens. Obviously, they will allow us to have gardens. Number one. And I think, where do we want to do? Where do we want to do? Industry to farther from the water? Yeah. Okay, let's uh, slow down time just a little bit whilst we work this out. Um, also, what we want to do is... Let's see, where does it say? F, custom... F1 is custom building. I want to make these relatively big... Because then they grow lots more food. And I know maybe they're not going to be able to afford these kind of houses. But. Um, needed, needed to get done. And I probably won't do that for all of them. But maybe I will. So we will see. Doo doo. You know, a little bit of wealth in a town never hurt. Uh, it's R and T. 
Maybe we just do, like, um... I don't know. The four of them this way. And then the rest we'll just do the normal way. And uh, we can speed time back up because... There's no reason not to. Now, do I want them all to look the same? Maybe. Yeah, we'll do three that way. And then, um, let's... We're getting awfully close to the Forester. Where's the red line? Okay, so it's over there. So if we did something like... Thing is, I know we're going to need food. So, I'm going to say this neighbor went crazy with his his house and uh, made it look weird. Like this. Perfect. How many did I say we need? Like, like nine or something. Yeah, nine. Okay, so there's... Still nine remaining. Hold shift to place multiple buildings. Yes, this is true. Um, yeah, I can't. I can't stop myself. I want to add a gap here for two or three reasons. Uh, one is because I, we're going to need a bridge there to get limestone. So we'll mine the gap. A little bit. go. Uh, let's push this forward a little bit. Like that. So that's, uh, what do we got there? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. And then we're gonna want just a few more on the out. Maybe um, we come around this direction a little bit. Kind of over here by the forest without showing into the forest, obviously, because we don't want that. Put the, this one out here like so. Awesome. And I love this game. This game's a good one. Uh, we have to do all this before winter. It's May, I think. We'll be fine. Uh, we'll just come to like here. You know, they don't all have to be massive. They have to pay taxes on the amount of land that they have when we set up taxes. Uh, I don't want them to have to pay an exuberant, exuberant, is that the word? Amount of taxes. Go this way without hitting trees? Yes, I can. Oh. I was not paying attention to, to the too long text. I did put one like this where the, the walkway goes way far back. Why not? Okay, I don't know how many we have now. One, two, one, two three, four, five, six, seven. So two more. Okay. Two more. We can put a, a massive one back here somewhere. Maybe like, like this. Got a couple houses. We're getting there. I've not done this before. Because I always forget that I can do this in the beginning. So, I'm only hoping this makes sense. And of course, this is, um, think of it as the first, you know, the first houses that came, or the first people that came, they were going to be really into f make, taking care of themselves by farming. You know, old. Jim Smith down the road. Big farmer. Big, big farmer. Okay. 
I think that's nine. <clears throat> now, do we have people not working? There's one man looking for a job. Okay, well, I would make him a builder, but we're going to need other stuff going on. For example, we're going to need water. A well, for sure. Um, we're going to need a couple of them because I, the way I did this probably. But we can put one well, like right here, I suppose, for now. If we hold control, we can change the speed of the rotation. But I think this is probably good. So let's put one there and then put another one kind of up against this guy's house here. Um, like this. Okay, uh, June. It is June, 1721. We need to build six houses. While they're being built, we should try doing decorations, it says. Sure. Sure. I'm also going to drink coffee while it's being built. There's benches and gazebos and whatnots. Um, get a couple of benches out. You realize the scale of these buildings once you zoom in a little bit. Um, where do we want benches? I don't know. I mean, these people, maybe they maybe they put built benches on the outside of their houses so they can rest. You know? Something like that. Actually, I kind of want to keep doing this. Um, bench. This would be nine, nine benches if we did all of them. And I have half a mind to do all of them. Just because I suddenly think it's a great idea. Yeah, I could see this happening IRL, right? Obviously spun that the wrong way. And here. This one's rotated a little bit differently, but no worries. And uh, here. Uh, here. Oops. Don't have to escape. Okay, perfect. Uh, they need water, right. Um... There is, I think, isn't there a, a well? Yeah, there's a well here. So, it's just that everyone has to use that well. So that's why there's that water problem. All right. They are getting the houses done uh, as quickly as possible. What is our lay log situation? 18 logs. Uh, bunches of firewood. There's one, two, three, four, five builders. Let's go down to four builders. And nobody's looking for a job. Interesting. Uh, we know we're going to need markets. We're going to need jobs in order to... To... Um, to get everybody... Moving in. So... We can get a market... Isn't it in, probably in here somewhere? Market stall. Let's start with one. And just, um, I think just like in the middle of town. Somehow. These tents are going to go away. I don't want it to be too far from everybody. But I spread everybody out, so it is going to be too far from everybody. Um, I want to... Set resource slots automatically, I guess. <clears throat> um, we'll put firewood in there for now. But we're also going to have to get like a granary and buy things from people. Which I think we'll do... Could do is just put it like right here. Sure. 
five more houses to go. I think we have that many. There's one, two, three, four. Did I miss one somewhere? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, we're good. We're good and we're fine. Now, let's also say the people of this town, in honor of the first uh, settlement area something, planted this spruce. Does this get big? Yeah, look at this. In the town center where it all started. Boom. Very cool. August 1721. This is what you would be doing if you were here. Okay, looking for a job. Fine. Can you... Let's just... Just get in there like that. Perfect. We're gonna need a trading post very, very soon. However, <clears throat> we also need a way to, to get nails. Well, let me see here. We have 1,000 iron and 843 nails. But we also have to... Make sure our stuff gets in order. Um, we're going to need all kinds of, like, the smithy in order to make nails. Um, charcoal, pi charcoal pile in order to keep that going. The lime works eventually is what we're going to need. Uh, hops, obviously. Let's see. I really think we probably need to get the trading post up and running fairly quickly because uh, we don't get iron here but I would also love to get sheep or cows but probably sheep mm-hmm which means we'll need hay but let's just um, let's see how this plays out we'll see how the first year goes um, there's still four houses to go one two Three. Oh yeah, and the fourth one way down there. Okay. I think I built too many, but that's fine because you have to have too many in order to to win. Check out this view. This game doesn't build multiple buildings at once. And so I don't know the benefit of building a construction office at this point. Um, yeah, I think we get a trading post very soon. And it's going to be outside of town, and the people are coming in, they're going to be... They're going to feel weird about it, but... Let's do it. Let's face the town like this. But eventually... This will be surrounded by all kinds of stuff. Um, I built the granary because I want to buy food from the villagers. <clears throat> so, that's why. Three houses to go. Very cool. One, two, maybe I didn't. Three, four. So I'm going to put this one on pause. At least for now. Move it down the queue so that that's. I think that's smart. And hopefully these roads will pan themselves out. I don't like the way they are now, but. Gonna be okay. Which firewood do we have? Lots. Good. Keep an eye on the drinking water as well. That they'll get they'll get built as we need them. It's October. Really could use more looking for a job. Be a builder. Why not? Get in there. Maybe go down here and be another builder. Perfect. This 
it's a good game for just watching and sipping coffee. So thank you to the members for supplying the coffee so we can watch this house get built and I can sip coffee. Appreciate it. Uh, if you haven't already, hit the like button, subscribe. It's going to be a long awesome series if I can help it. We are going to uh, we'll get lots done and survive. Survive! I'm going to hide that map so that we can have a beautiful view of everything. Man, I just... I'd live here. If town was right down the road. Look at this. It's gorgeous. There's a nice stream. There's land for miles. Now, the, of course, the way that this game w w works, everybody's able to just... There's no ownership of land. The, I own the land, I guess. But... I guess they own their property a little bit, but I can just destroy a house if I ever wanted to. The point is, the kids could run all the way to that to, to the woods over there. Sure, there's probably wolves or bears, but you teach your kids to survive those kind of things. But look at this. They could run up the paddle up the river if they wanted to and just go and go and go. There's this little loop here. It's just beautiful. It's beautiful. However, it's November. My kids need to get back home because winter is coming. And uh, that's not, not ideal. Because when winter comes, well, everybody's going to be cold unless uh, they get inside their houses. So that's what we're hoping for. Winter, please don't come yet. Very good. Man, the ladies did a great job of making sure there was plenty of thatch. Uh, see how this one looks with the house pushed back? Kind of like that. There's a path up the middle. All these benches get used. I should have done this last time. Whereas the ones where the, the houses are kind of pushed forward, <clears throat> they're cool too. But not as cool. Oh, there's no smoke coming out of this house for a second, and I was wondering if uh, <clears throat> maybe they didn't have enough firewood. But look, look at all the smoke from the wood fireplaces. Just a beautiful game. Now, I know. Farthest Frontier was maybe a little more beautiful, but this one's... It's good. The auto saves. Don't break the game. Just good. Alright, so this is the camp storage. Why is there... This is an empty tent, so that'll be gone soon. A well. This um, this is cool, the campfire, but unfortunate. And the uh, the log benches, super cool. And there is our. Okay, so we need to start fixing the. Um... No, they're leaving. Oh, how did we not get a house done fast enough? Okay, recommends that we build farms for livestock uh, yeah and we're gonna do farms however it's also gonna tell us that our other thing is falling apart our carts and we're going to need carpentry to repair stuff so I think we're gonna start back here with that kind of stuff uh, maybe we don't do the trading post quite yet. Let's do it like in this kind of an order. Can't believe that a family moved out. That's unbelievable. Unbelievable. And then, yeah, let's, we'll get a farm, of course. We'll get a farm. Um, I bet you it's super fertile over here. Let's see. Just put it like uh, back side of this forest. Eventually, none of work. Oh, oh no. Okay, builders. I'm gonna go down to four builders because we need workers. Now, in order to attract somebody, we're gonna need food for sale. 
wells are done, we'll get the granary and then we will get food for sale. And I'm just going to press the automatic buttons because I did not know that they existed last time we played. <laughs> but um, they seem like a really cool idea. Uh, your carts are wearing out. Yeah, see, that's that's coming up. The carpentry. So, our carts are wearing out. We're going to repair them. I, well aware. Well aware. Hopefully all these people have plenty of food. They do. And they should have so much food that we can buy it from the, the market. Or buy it in our granary and sell it at the market. So that the people make an income. And our town as a whole makes an income. A little crazy the same people that are selling people or that are selling uh, food have to buy food <clears throat> but you know if you're selling leeks and you want to buy onions it makes sense they also get paid at their jobs so the wives maybe are at home farming it's a beautiful winter it is January by the way happy new year 1722 made it okay so what we do is we put a worker or two in here and then we say set resources automatically to buy from locals. We'll do that one first. None done. Perfect. And then we'll say buy from the locals while we can afford all this stuff. Very cool. And then we'll go over here and we will fill these in. Honey and peas. So honey and peas came in so far. Perfect. I love it. Get the carts fixed very soon. Uh, the carts are over here. They are almost completely broken. Uh, we have to build. We have 239 nails left, which means we need a smithy. In order to make a smithy, we're also going to need charcoal, I believe. But let's get the smithy started. Um, does it need nails? It needs 112 nails. So we gotta be careful if we don't screw this up and find out that uh, we can't. Let's do the smithy first because the trading post takes 200 nails. Yeah, so. Oh no, we're out of nails. <clears throat> I think that they're going to get. The nails hopefully from here yes okay they're stealing the nails <laughs> and going to the smithy perfect let's get a charcoal pile so we can get some charcoal on the go uh, we're gonna make the charcoal downwind by a lot we'll just put it over here somewhere kind of spreading out because um i can besides it that it doesn't appear like we're spread out much right I don't think. Did we get anything else in here that we, the market can sell? Yeah, beetroot. Very good. Honey, peas, and beetroot. I'm sure that's fine. And yeah, we need to build a farm. But if, if they're buying their own food, selling their own food right now, we'll be alright. Us family settled in, thank goodness. I'm not ready to add a carpenter. Well, yeah, we better. We'll add a carpenter. There's no one to do it, but <clears throat> eventually. Look at all this stuff in the granary. I love it. We'll probably get another marketplace. Um, market to stall. Because. Um, why? Uh, because we can fill it up, fill it up with more stuff. Pumpkins, garlics, cabbage, and marrow. I'll, yeah. I think we're doing things better this time around. Oh, we need a worker. I thought that it would be a lady, but maybe not. And then here is our smithy. And the smithy will begin making nails as soon as we have someone that can make nails. Uh, yeah, and then we will... Um, gonna have to undo this house start to this house eventually because 
we're going to need to. February, oh, the thaw. The beautiful thaw. The smithy's done, by the way. But we're watching the thaw, so we can't do anything about that yet. Beautiful. River's flowing again. People are coming out of their houses to work. Hey, there's our, there's our um, sediment tree. The spruce tree. Okay, so we're going to need this. Fortunately, we don't have workers for any of our buildings right now. Um, how many builders do we have? I don't want to go down in builders, but... I guess we have to. We'll go down to two. Everybody has such a long walk in this game. But, it's okay. Okay, so now we have... There's plenty of iron. You'll get iron, don't worry. And metal parts for repairs, right. I should have built the smithy first, apparently. Okay, we have charcoal, and we have iron, we have nails. Nails are coming in, thank goodness for that. Look at this lady's dress. Wow. This is uh, Christina Harvzokshow. Har Very healthy. Man. She arrived in March 1721. That was a year ago today. She arrived. Well, welcome, Christina. Very cool. Uh, this game, I can't name people, right? Right. Yeah. Hello, he says. Yeah, we're going to build more houses. Uh, you know, give me, a, give me a minute. Okay, we're going to get a farm first. Uh, it does take quite a bit of resources, of which we have. And then we'll go ahead and I guess do the house next before we do the trading post. So we're going to need a lot, a lot of um, nails. How much iron do we have? 950, 20 nails, eek. I just want to make sure. Now, iron comes from, like, hills and stuff, I think. It was very easy to... What was this? Oh, more limestone. It was very easy for me to find it on the last map. But I'm going to say that this map has exactly zero iron. It's not a mountain anywhere, or not a mountain range. Okay, I don't even know if I press, if I go to like here and go to iron mine, is that, is this, is this where it is? Uh, iron mine. Oh, it doesn't have the, uh, the green dots or anything to give me a hint, but all the carts need to be repaired. I bet they do. Can you... You're making metal parts? Yes. So... I do want to perform preventive repairs as well. <clears throat> I think he is. I think he's fixing them. Yeah, he's getting wood. And he's going to get metal. We're fine. This farm is almost built. It is April, so we probably aren't going to be able to, to plant much, but nevertheless. All right, I'm going to refill my coffee. Um, what entire nations are we waiting for here? Here they come. It's because we don't have carts. They actually have to carry everything by hand. I'll be right back. My anniversary. Happy anniversary, my dear. 
There, uh, have, has he started? Oh, he, there's carts. I saw someone grab a cart. Yeah. Good. Now they can cart things a little bit. There he is, carting things. Good. The game wants me to build uh, new houses, of course, but we have to get everything done in a certain way or we will be in big trouble. I kind of want to get on the market. Uh, there's apples. Uh, we're gonna need, ugh, we're gonna need shoes and stuff soon. There's so much to do, and uh, so little time. Perfect, perfect. Go oh, horseradish and apples. Okay, so not a, not a lot of stuff, but I want them to be happy with a, a, a variety of food. Can't find thatch anywhere. Apparently, we just used up all of our thatch. I did not even know that that was a problem, or that we weren't getting thatch. That's crazy, crazy. I tell you. Um, all right, we have this town storage it has iron in it. Okay, well. Camp center, wish we could get rid of that. We'll get rid of all that stuff eventually. The spruce tree will be the remaining... The last thing eventually. Kind of half tempted to say that we would have built a fence around it. So that generations from now, people will ask, What in the world is there a spruce tree with a fence around it for and um of course the old the old men and women in the town will remind the kids this is where people settled in 17 21 years before you were even born my child and um Holy smokes, it'll be, a, it'll be a time for tales, for sure. Not around the campfire, which eventually we're going to have to get rid of. But, they're also going to ask, why is this bench not parallel to the, to the fence? By the gate, or the bench, yeah, why is the bench not parallel? And we won't have an answer, because nobody will have remembered who built it. I certainly don't remember who built it. <clears throat> Farm is almost built. We are just waiting for the thatch. And here it comes. It got dropped off. So we just need it to... Um, <clears throat> yeah. To get going here. I wish that we had known... Or I'd have known that we weren't getting thatch. Because thatch has to dry. You see, it's... Well... It's green. And then it dries. It must not take long to dry, since uh, they're all getting it done. But look, there's plenty of thatch here. How much do you need? Five hundred. Okay, well, another year without a farm, probably not for the best. But and see, this is the problem with the game. They could be getting this village house started. You know. They're waiting for thatch. Well, bring the material. What are you doing? But no. Uh, they won't do that. No. Just put up like one piece of roof. <clears throat> Let's just double check that this is full. Yes. Okay. <clears throat> We're paying a lady to do, to sell two items, but you know. Look at this. Isn't that so cool? What's underneath? Oh, there was a person buying there or something. Oh, where it's oh, there's like you can see it's pumpkins and was that garlic, garlic, and cabbage and marrow. That's so cool, isn't it? I think so. Horseradish. I do like a good horseradish on certain uh, sandwiches, like a Reuben for one. How much are we waiting for? Oh, we need eleven 1 hundred. 800 is coming. 
Okay, we've got the thatch is on its way. Golly, this is the longest farm build ever. Is there any men in? The There's two men looking for a job. Well, build. How about that? All right, so our total nails is up to 67, and we're going to need some for this house, 77, but 486 for the silly. But we need the, we have to have the trading post in order to get um, more iron ore. So uh, definitely. I want to get that on the go. Look how much of this forest we've already taken out. Crazy. Look, see, look at these fields. They've got they've got honey, and what is this buckwheat? <clears throat> very good, very good. Half tempted to get another one of these. I mean, it is not full by any stretch. <clears throat> but uh, it's there. Are we costing ourselves a fortune? Um, balance. Income. Is the income the one that lets me know if we're winning? Or is it the balance? I can never remember. I'm guessing we're losing money, right? I'm, I'm certain of it. Pretty certain that we lost 500 it's not the thousands that we've lost in past games, but we're probably buying just a ton of. Does this pause the game? No, it doesn't. Okay, we're probably buying a ton of um, local sales. This is I go expenses import. Oh, I guess I don't know. I don't know what these expenses are here. Oh, it's salaries, right? Local purchases, 477. We're paying 90%. We're probably paying too much, but we can't fix that without a, um, a governor's place or something. Um, the town hall. But we don't have enough. We don't have enough people for all that. So, holy smokes, will you please put the finishing touches on this building? Good grief, we've been here waiting and waiting. Okay, finally. Good night. Let's get out of the field. Um, we're going to go this way with our field. Put the entrance over there. So we'll go something like this as big as we can, which is 50 by 50 by 50 by 50. 200, 2,480, I think I misclicked, but we don't want wheat. We want, um, or maybe we do want wheat. Make bread? Or do we want, let's get, um, let's get potatoes. Um, also, we're going to need a couple of workers, and we need to activate the field. Uh, they weren't, they're not going to plant it in August, I hope. Season's over yet. But we are going to do another field. Let's just uh, do it the opposite side. Make it a little bit identical. 50 by 50 by 50 by 50. Too long. Which way is too long? 9 50 by 50 by 50 by 50. Boom. And this is not going to be potatoes. We need to rotate things. So potatoes use green and <clears throat> orange. But everything is just green and orange. So maybe, I don't know. Flax would be nice. Oh, for crying out loud. I guess, um... Everything uses green and orange. Like, we could alternate flax and buckwheat, but why would we do that? Fine, we're gonna do wheat. And, uh, we'll convert wheat into other things when we can. 
I don't know how many fields. I guess three. We can handle three. Do I put a gap? Yeah, we're gonna put a gap. Another field. Because... Oh, did we screw up the, the one dimension? That's a shame. Why does this field look bigger? Maybe I'm nuts. 50 by 50 by 50 by 50 by 49. Um, and then let's... Uh, barley. We could do sunflowers. I don't think it's necessary. I forget what flax gives us. Flax... Flax seeds and other things just don't have the production for everything. Barley, of course, that does something. Let's just do another field of potatoes. Okay, the house is built. Um, we ha should have jobs available, yes. Um, so, <clears throat> what do we want to do at this point? We want to... I really want to get this built, but how many nails do we have now? It doesn't really matter, because we have to get a trading post, or we will not have iron, or very soon. Plus, if we want to buy shoes, <clears throat> or if we want to get animals of some kind, maybe that's... Oh, this is not... Look at this terrible field design. So we could get another field, right? Yeah, it does let you. I wonder what the max is. Hey, a new family settled in. It is the Krutaholava family. They have a little five-year-old boy. Very little income. That's all right. Well, they brought sallow and dried fish. We oh, That's the other thing. It's probably need to get fish coming in. We have no meat. I would love to have cows, maybe. All that takes a lot of people, and we're going to need a lot of houses soon. Oh boy, I think we're going to start going to townhouses, though. I think I think there's probably plenty of... Are we selling the beetroot? We are. Okay. Well, good grief. We are going to need another granary. And the other greenery is going to be just for um, the stuff that the town is making and not what the people are making, if that makes sense. Perfect. And I know the town roads are a little bit hickledy-pickledy, as a man once said, uh, but we'll, we'll get it all taken care of. Don't you dare worry. We're also down to seven hundred and thirty dollars, but um, <clears throat> we're gonna have a lot to sell eventually. How's our carts? Where's our carts? They're all being used, which is probably good. We need two hundred and ninety-five nails. Crazy, I know. He's recommending we do a town hall, but like I said, if we don't get the uh, the other stuff, the the trading post and all that kind of thing done, then we will be out of luck very quickly. And we don't want to be out of luck. Trust me. Also, start, we could get stone coming in. Oh, there's so much we could do here, but all of it's kind of a waiting game, or we don't want it, not a waiting game per se, but we don't want to rush into things and not have workers and then be uh, in big trouble. <clears throat> there is a man looking for a job. Kind of think maybe we get him working at the smithy and tell him to uh, make nails, please. Please make nails. Definitely gonna need more houses. Um, just regular village houses.
I get kind of think it'd be kind of fun to, to put them sideways. We did three there. Maybe two or three. I mean, we can't get three, but maybe two here. No, there's uneven terrain. There certainly is. This, this is another hilly map, but yeah. We're going to be all right. We'll be all right. It is almost the end of the year. Okay, I, I know we need to build a town hall. I'm not doing it now. Please stop telling me. Look at all this clay. Yum. Not really. It does look like it would be tasty, doesn't it, clay? Really tempted to get rid of this, the campfire and stuff. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. But that's our history. Well... It was our history. Now the last thing <laughs> in the history books is the giant spruce tree that we all remember. Jack. Probably not Jack. I'd have to find someone that was here from the beginning. <clears throat> Zinovkiv planted, maybe. I'm blessed to have a roof over my head and food on the table. Indeed you are, sir. Indeed you are blessed. I can't believe what we've done with this this terrible design here. But oh well. I don't remember what what does what do we do with lime? Well, we make it into lime works, which makes quick lime. And then we make it put it into lime Quick climb. Both of these produce quick climb. Oh, this produces lime. And then I don't know what we do with lime. Who knows? What I do know is I probably want to get. Do we cows or sheep? I mean, we can make so much more from sheep. You can make milk from the goats you can make uh, for the male male sheep female sheep not the goats uh, milk from from the goat from the sheep and then you can get leather from them wool from them and meat right I think you can also get meat if I had to guess <clears throat> let's see production sheep. Well, it says production of wool and milk. It does not say anything about... ...food. But... Yeah, mutton. You can produce mutton, which is sheep milk meat. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. The sheep farm building can only hold 500 units of hay. So we need hay... Oh, it uses hay dryers, which is... Very good. I, yeah, I think sheep is definitely the way we're going to go. How many nails do we have? Ten nails. How much nails do we need left? Only five. Okay, so it's just wood and clay left, and we we have that. Yeah, I think 1724 is going to be a good year. I really do. We're going to start trading, which this really turns into some kind of uh, crazy thing here time of the year. Yep, just getting wood and clay. And we should have plenty of wood. Uh, 9,000, yeah. And then clay is infinite. So just a matter of time. <clears throat> just carting in the wood, carting in the clay. Uh, they'll start building when they get more clay. I think. Now there's like a there's like this little chart <clears throat> that you can barely see. And it tells you what's needed when. <clears throat> but like I said, you can barely see it. Happy New Year, by the way, 1723. And uh, who boy, we are actually let's get three people 
at least three ladies working in here. How many ladies do we need? Jobs. Looking for jobs. Women. One. Okay. No. Four. Perfect. Very perfect. Because we are going to thaw in just another month or two. What are we waiting on? Nothing. All the resources are collected. The four builders should get on it uh, pretty quickly. Awesome. We, I love it. They're doing great. You see that guy with the red jacket? The two of them. That's pretty fancy. Pretty fancy red jacket they've got going on there. Let's turn this way and we can watch the uh, the thaw. I want the sun and everything. It's beautiful. <clears throat> it's very, very lovely. Our spruce trees growing. <clears throat> Grandpa, tell me about the good old days. There you go. That's the only singing you're here, and if you've made it this far in the video, well, you were. You got that little treat. Thanks for watching so, so long into the video. Oh my word, build this place. These people are slow. To be fair, they're uneducated. Uh, All they know is how to pick things up and nail them. They don't have any concept of um, laying things out so that it can be done faster. Uh, it's just, it is just, it looks like this needs to go here. Let's put it there. It's a miracle these buildings survive and don't fall down. They probably don't fall down because the sheer amount of nails that they're putting in each board. I, mean, I forget how many how many nails we get have to put in here. I guess 300 doesn't seem like a lot, but nevertheless, well, well, well. Yeah, things are going at what I would call swimmingly. Let's fire one lady from there because don't need her getting that much read at this point in our lives. Build, my friends. Build. Okay, February, the end of March. Here comes the thaw. Any second now. If this building wasn't so elaborate, it wouldn't take this long to build. But they really... They really, uh... Wanted it to look amazing. I guess you're, you're trying to impress your neighbors. You know? You really need them to buy some stuff and things. Oh, it's thawing. A beautiful spring day at the end of February. <clears throat> Hope you guys didn't uh, forget the Valentine's Day is coming up. Don't forget... It is March. My mother's birthday has come and gone. And we are now ready to get a worker or two in here. Um, I can't fill this in. But we're going to... Um, <clears throat> what? Is there no charcoal? Fine. I don't... They never buy the... Like the peas and stuff, right? Let's like we could put, let's put just um, two hundred thatch in here and see if it sells. And then I guess we'll do beetroot and cabbage. I'm not selling the firewood, the garlic and the honey, and the horseradish, marrow, and you know peas and pumpkin, pump, pumpkin, sure. And we could buy all of it. Let's just. Do a hundred of everything for now, just to see if uh, if it works out. We're going to have to fire some builders in order to get a person in here. Apparently, um, and yeah, we'll just we'll buy it for now. Okay, 
So let's uh, do a builder. Could slow down with the building anyway because um, the next thing is going to be some crazy house building, and um, we don't want to get too carried away. It should be laborers. Yeah, there's not. But <clears throat> hopefully this all gets planted rather quickly. Do we say hire laborers? Yeah, we do. There's just, there is nobody. There's no laborers. Everybody's got work to do. So hopefully they get that taken care of. Well, it is the end of March, 1723. We're farming. We've got housing. We've got... Um, trading available no trading yet but there will be and when there is we will be ready with um beetroots and garlic let's get a labor person in here and fill with production we will fill with production very soon i'll catch you guys next monday i hope to see you then goodbye